Here is a recipe for making chicken Sindhi beef biryani at home. Wash the basmati rice thoroughly and soak it in water for 30 minutes. Drain the water and set the rice aside. Heat ghee in a large pot or deep pan. Add the sliced onions and cook until golden brown. Add the ginger garlic paste and saute for a minute until raw smell disappears. Add the chopped tomatoes and cook until they become soft and mushy. Add the chicken and beef pieces to the pot and mix well. Cook for five, seven minutes until the meat is browned. Add the biryani masala, turmeric powder, red chili powder, and salt. Mix well and cook for another five minutes. Add the yogurt, mint leaves, and coriander leaves. Mix everything well and cook for 10 minutes until the meat is tender. In a separate pot, boil water and add the soaked and drained rice. Cook the rice until it is 70% cooked and then drain it. Preheat your oven to 180 degrees Celsius, 350 degrees Fahrenheit, or gas mark 4. Layer half of the cooked rice on top of the meat mixture in the pot. Sprinkle half of the garam masala powder and half of the fried onions on the rice. Add the remaining rice on top and sprinkle the rest of the garam masala powder and fried onions. Pour milk over the layers and cover the pot with a lid. Seal the lid with aluminum foil to prevent steam from escaping. Place the pot in the preheated oven and bake for about 30 minutes or until the rice is fully cooked and the flavors have infused. Once done, remove from the oven and let it rest for a few minutes before serving. Serve hot and enjoy your homemade chicken Cindy beef biryani. Note, you can also cook this biryani on stovetop using a large pan or pot. In that case, after layering the rice and meat mixture, cover the pot with a tight-fitting lid and cook on low heat for 30-35 minutes.